Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for watching today's gift guide video. I love making these videos, I think they are so much fun. One of my favorite things to do is to give presents and I don't know, I feel like I'm kind of good at coming up with fun and creative gifts for people. So today's video is about what to get the guy in your life. Specifically, I'm thinking like you know, like a boyfriend or husband for Valentine's Day. So I'm not going to do a lot of chit chat in the beginning. I'm just going to jump right into it because I know you guys just want to know what to get that guy in your life. So here we go. <laughs> All right, so the first thing that I have for you guys is really cool. It is something that I know that my husband personally wants, and it is the Apple HomePod. And there's two versions. There's a normal version that's about $300, and then there's a mini version, which is honestly basically the same as the normal version or the, the regular version. If it was me, I would go for the mini version, but you do you. But basically it's like an Alexa, so it works as a smart home device. So it connects to your iPhone and you can talk to it and you can use Siri and all of that good stuff. And some of the other cool features that it has is that it, again, it works as a speaker, but you could also pair it to your stereo. So if you have other Apple products like an Apple TV and stuff like that, you can pair it to that and it can work seamlessly with those different interfaces, which is cool. And then also, if you get multiple ones, you can put them in different areas of your house and it works like an intercom, which, I mean, I don't necessarily know if I would ever use that feature, but it's still cool that it's there. So if you're guys like a techie person, I think this would be a really cool gift. And it's Apple, so you know you're getting good quality. So that is the first thing that I have for you guys. All right, this next one is really fun. So typically, the stereotypical gift to give a girl is a heart-shaped box of chocolate, which, I mean, cool, I like chocolate. But, so this is the guy version of that. It's a heart-shaped box, but it's full of beef jerky. This box, it's from Mancrate, and it comes with 10 different types of jerky. So they open up the box, and it's just full of these 10 different, individually packed, different flavors of beef jerky. And beef jerky is like kind of on the pricier side of snacks to buy, but this box you get 10 different kinds and it's only $40. So super affordable, honestly. And I just think it would be cute to like pull out a heart shaped box and give it to your guy and they're like, what the heck is this? And then it's like delicious beef jerky. So I don't know, I think it's super creative. And when I saw it, I was like, that is genius. <laughs> so that is number two on my list. All right, number three is something that's really cute and personalized. They are personalized socks, and I think these are just so adorable. One of the things my husband loves are different cool patterned socks. So these you can get personalized, and you can get, so like we just had our daughter Charlie, so if I was to get these socks for my husband, I would get her face on them. So it's basically just like her face all over the socks, super cute. But you can also get like, if you have a dog or a cat or any type of pet, or even you can put your face on the socks, which would be really cute. And personalized socks, I don't know, I feel like they're cute and also kind of funny because it's just like literally just like the outline of your head. So you're like a floating head on a sock, but it's a cute and thoughtful gift for that special someone. <laughs> All right, and I had to include something from Amazon because I am an Amazon stan. I love Amazon Prime. So this next one is on Amazon and it is on Prime as well. So if you're one of those last minute shoppers, like we all are sometimes, let's be honest, this is a great gift. It is a whiskey glass at the same time as a cigar holder too. And I know like cigars, not everyone is super into them, but they are a cool thing and a nice thing to have on special occasions like Valentine's Day. So I just thought this would be a really cool thing to have. And it still has like that classic look, even though it is like a two in one type thing. I feel like the glass was crafted in a really nice way. So if you are with a guy who enjoys cigars and whiskey, I just think it would be cool to kind of like do that as a bundle gift, a little like guys night in gift baskets. So you can have your nice bottle of whiskey, a cool thing of cigars and the glass and they're all set. And keeping with that trend of alcohol and glasses and stuff, a bartending kit I think would be another really cool gift to give somebody. There's different levels of bartending kits that you can get. Like my husband, he went to bartending school and so he's super into craft cocktails. So we have a kit that's from Williams Sonoma and it's really, really pretty and really nice, but it was a couple hundred dollars. So if that's in your budget and you can spend that much, um, there are a really, there are a few really nice ones on Williams Sonoma. 
Um, or there's also some beginner starter kits on Amazon that are super cool. We got one for my sister for Christmas, actually this past Christmas, and it was like a 20 piece bartending kit and it was like $40 or something. So super cool and useful. And it's also like having a bar kit and having all those little tools and stuff, it just kind of makes you feel more like a professional bartender or whatever. So whether they are just starting out in cocktails or if they are like a husband and super into crafted cocktails, a bartending kit is really nice. And if they are into more of those crafted cocktails, it is a really nice gesture to get them the nicer shakers and nicer jiggers and stuff like that. It's just like another step up in the craft. But I just really like this gift because it's really budget friendly. So no matter what your budget is, you can find something within it and it's still really cool and really fun to play with and experiment. All right, moving right along. The next thing that I have is a tile mate. And if you have never heard of tile mate, it is basically just like a little um, square tile shaped um, device that you can hook on your keys and it is like a key finder. So if your boyfriend or husband is constantly losing their keys or misplacing them, get them the tile mate. It connects to your phone, it can connect to your Alexa or whatever you have. And then if you've lost something, you just go to the app and click on the find button and it will let you know where it is. So it'll save them and you probably a lot of time, stress and a headache being able to know exactly where those keys are. And they even sell them in like packs of four too. So if there is multiple things that you wanna put it on, you're good. And the last thing that I have for you guys is a good old fashioned shaving kit. There is nothing better than having a nice kit that has all of the essentials in it. There's a lot of different brands, and I mean, you can always, you know, go with your preferred brand or their preferred brand. My husband, in particular, he likes the Jack Black one, so I'm gonna link to one in the description below for that brand, but you can pick any different brand, again, depending on your price range as well. But it's a gift where you can give them a little bit of luxury at home and give them all their essentials in one place, so it's something that they're gonna use every day or every other day and it's a gift for them and also a gift for you because I don't know, my husband has a little bit of facial hair and I always know that it's time for him to shave when he kisses me on the cheek or kisses me and it's like pricking me and poking me and it hurts. So it can be a nice gift for him and then also a gift for you because you can be like, go use your new shaving kit because you're poking me. So that is all the gift ideas that I have for you guys for this year. I hope it was helpful. And if you end up using one of the gifts that I recommended, please let me know in the comments below. I would love to know. And don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. If you are new here, I would love if you would consider sticking around and hitting that subscribe button. I am here for you at least once a week, if not twice a week with videos on home decor, cleaning, organization, lifestyle, mom life homemaking, lots of things we do here. So please hit that subscribe button if you are new here. I would love if you would stick around. I hope you all have a great day and a fantastic, romantic, magical Valentine's Day. And I will see you in my next video in a couple of days. Bye.